Okay, so let's talk about this right now with Dr. Harish Morjani. He is an infectious disease specialist with Phelps Hospital and Northwell Health. Doctor, if our hospitals reach capacity, how do we handle it? Can we handle it? Yeah, so the good news is we've been through this before in, in March and April and May when we had above capacity and we managed it by expanding our bed capacity, by recruiting staff and by training our staff. Uh, the good news this time around is we are seeing the surge and we have lots more patients today than we had, let's say three weeks ago, but we have a staff that is trained. We have knowledge now that has emerged over the last few months that allows us to treat these people more aggressively. We are giving monoclonal antibodies, for example, that are preventing hospitalizations to begin with. People are not presenting late in the disease as much, so the severity is much less. We know how to handle those early cases and we are discharging them and we are prepared to expand capacity. We already have plans in place. We have no PPE shortage. All our medical staff, all of those that wanted the vaccine and accepted the vaccine have now been vaccinated. They're three and a half weeks out. So protection is there. So I think we are well prepared, much better prepared this time than we were in during the first surge. So we are not seeing the level of, of overcapacity and frustration and uh, and fatigue that right. we saw amongst the healthcare's before this time around.